Hey there, I'm Luke the Cooking Camper, and there is Xena the Glamper Camper, the Timu Influencer! And we have to do a little correction video. So, I did not actually know how to use this $33.99 portable collapsible washing machine when I made my first video. So today, we're going to try it again, doing it the way that everyone else tells me I'm supposed to use it. Okie dokie. So the first thing you do is you just want to pull it up. Just like that. Now in my initial video, I inserted this right away and used it on the wash cycle because I thought that this was what actually spun the clothes. Well, this is apparently not supposed to go in until the dry cycle, just like as a spin dry. So this alone is gonna spin your clothes up. So right now, I've already got the power block plugged in, but I'm gonna put in some clothes. I got a shirt, a pair of underwear, and I don't think we'll be able to fit in two swim trunks. That would be pretty tight. So we'll just stick with that one swim trunks. Honestly, even without the basket in it, it doesn't really add much room. So I guess we'll see if it makes a difference at all that it's not in there. Right now I'm just filling up the washing machine with some water and I'm still gonna go up to the same line. I'm gonna go up to right to the line of the top of the part that collapses. Okay, so we just got to the top of that line. Now we're going to set it right here so that we can suction cup it in. So that it doesn't move around on us. We're going to add in our soap. I'm going to add in the same amount in between two and three ounces. Okie dokie. So to start, we just long press. And now we're on that one. So it should run for about 15 minutes. Oh yeah, so it is actually spinning everything around in there. Okie dokie, so I guess it's true. Without this basket, your clothes will still spin around. That little thing in the bottom spins them quite nicely. But what I'm gonna try this time that I didn't try last time is I wanna see how well this will kind of dry out the clothes after they're already washed. Okay, so the wash cycle just finished. So let's get this thing drained. Okay, so it has been drained out. I rinsed off my um, clothes just with some fresh water. Now this just clicks right in. So now that's in there. So we are just going to Put the clothes in there, which see now they don't all fit in that little white thing. So not really sure how well this is going to work. There's also not a button for dry. Unless maybe that's what semi-hydration means. Let's try that. Yeah, so the shirt already came off. Let's see if it dries the shorts at all. There are swim trunks and a pair of underwear. I have a feeling that this function, I mean, you can do this if you want to, but I don't really know how effective it is. I would rather just either hang them to dry or like I did the other day, I just popped them in the dryer after I ran them on a wash cycle in this. Okay, so it's done. And as you can see, it's still dripping. Really dried it hardly at all. So like I said, I would prefer to just hang dry these or throw them in the dryer. 
I still really like this washing machine. It works really, really well as a washing machine. As a dryer, I've got to be honest, it doesn't do anything for me. But I just wanted to show you guys that it was, this was like the intended purpose for many of the videos online that I've seen. If you liked this video, make sure to give us a big thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to head to the description box and check out our links and promo codes for Timu, especially for new users. Zena just wants to thank you guys for watching another one of her videos, and she wants to tell you to get out and enjoy nature and food as much as we do. Have a great one.